Hello YouTubers, um, today I'm going to show you how to get the Aether mod and for 1.5.2. It's a pretty good mod, so um, first you're going to force update your game to avoid any crashing, errors, or lags, or stuff. Then once you do that, you this this mod requires WinRAW or 7-Zip. WinRAW or 7-Zip, it doesn't matter which one you get. The link will be in the description to download it. Um, I'm using WinRAW right now, so... If, once you download that, go to the link in the description where the Aether mod is and download it. It won't, it won't, you won't get a virus on your computer, so you don't need to worry. So now, once you download the th WinRAW or 7-Zip, then the mod, drag, just put it on your desktop to make it easier. Go to Start, then type in the search bar, which says Search Programs and Files. Go to Percent App Data Percent. Then once there will be a roaming folder, so go to that, then go to Minecraft. Now this part will be really tricky, so I recommend paying attention. I'll go really slow so you can understand. So go before you do this part, go to the desktop, right click, and make a new folder. You can rename it if you want, but I'll just call it new folder. So open up the folder you made, drag it to the side. Now you're going to take all of these files, you can either highlight it or control A, which is select all, drag into the folder that you made. If X out of it first, because if you drag one, copy one thing and paste it in, it'll just take everything. So, first thing you need to do is go to saves in the folder. Go to copy, saves, and go to the dot minecraft, right click and go to paste. Now saves will be in here. The next thing you'll need is texture packs. Copy this. Go to the dot Minecraft and click paste. Now texture packs is in here. The last thing you're gonna need is last login right here. Right click it, go to copy last login, then go to dot Minecraft, right click, and go to paste. Now these are the only three things you're gonna need. Um let's see. You can X you can X out of this folder now. So these are the only three things you're going to need. So once you got all those, go to Minecraft, then log in as usual, but keep make sure to keep this folder right here. And once it's done loading, you'll see some files appear. Okay, so you'll see some files appear like this. And you can you can exile your Minecraft now. So once it does that, X out of Minecraft. Sometimes my computer can just be really stupid. Okay, so. Oh my gosh, you stupid Minecraft. Alright. I'll just. Alright. So close your Minecraft. Now, this time go to bin. Then go to this Minecraft chart. Minecraft right here. Right click. Go to open with WinRAW or 7-zip. You are not going to need this folder anymore, so you can delete that. So once you force up your game, update your game. Sorry, there will be this folder called Meta Inf. What you need to do is you have to delete this thing, or else the mod won't work and you'll crash your Minecraft. So the last step is you open up the Aether mod that you downloaded. Um, go to Mod in Minecraft. Go to Minecraft.jar. And then go. There will be another file appearing. Go to Minecraft.jar, then take all these files, Control A, then drag it to here. It might, and then let it extract. It might take a sec, or it might take a minute or less. Then click OK, um, and let it extract again. Then you're done. So you can go you download the Aether mod. Now let's check it out. Okay. So if you done these steps right, you should see something like this. This is this is if you've done it right. Now you can you can like toggle world, you can do this, you can, you can do that. Or you can do this, like this is a this is a world I made already. Or you can do this, and they'll be like that. Ether theme toggle world like this. Um, yes. So 
I'll sh and now I'll show you how to build the Aether. So now, yeah. So like I'll show you the things they add. Like they add some armor, boxing gloves, a shield, a cape, some rings, and I'll show you what they added. And this is just like a book. And this one is a parachute. So, so it's like it's to build the Aether. Um, it's exactly like a Nether portal except you use. Um, gold lowstone input, wa bucket of water in the middle, and let's go in and I'll show you it. Entering the aether. So now, as you see, you're in this place right here. See, like there's a land over there. There's clouds, and there's another. And this comes with a parachute. This parachute will like break your fall. Like I'll I'll show you. So if you fall out of this world, you will not die. Um, you'll just leave the aether, and I think I see a cloud right there. I think it breaks your fall. So, and I'll show you how this um, parachute works. You all you do is right click, and then you'll gently float down and right click it again if you want to disable the parachute. I think that's how you do it. Leaving the aether. So that's what happens when you um um. So that's what happens when you fall out of the world. I think it's sneak. I think it's sneak mode to get out of the parachute. Or I think you right click again. Yeah, so th th this has been a Minecraft mod tutorial. Thanks for watching and please subscribe. Peace.